Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Painting Hyun. Today, our topic is how to draw a tree that looks three-dimensional. Sketchbooks here, we're gonna simple sketch. Let me say of the right source, this is the sun. So the right source is coming from this way. Then draw three simple circles to make a large tree. Then draw trunk in the center and branches with unstretching the lines. The top of the tree is the lightest part and the darkest part is going to be on the right lower area. Okay, and here is the where the reflected light comes in. When we color, we will uh, paint it with the cerulean blue. And here is going to be shadow area. And let's get started uh, with a very simple sketch. Just needed to draw three circles and trunk and branches. And that's it. For today's colors, so leaf green, sap green, ultramarine deep, bonsina, cerulean blue. I'm going to take a light leaf green and just tapping on the light part of the trees as a first layer. For the reflected light part, I'm taking a light uh, cerulean blue to add white lower of the tree area. Next, I want to get dark green for second layer. So I'm mixing sap green, bon sienna, and a bit of leaf green. Then I'm taking the mixture to add on the right lower part of the each circles as a second layer. Because the sun's coming from left top hands area, so the brightest area is left top part, and darkest area is the right lower part of the tree. This paper is still wet, so they are kind of breathing into each other quickly. So it's gonna be look very smooth and uh, beautiful. I'm making more dark green, adding on the center lower uh, right lower area. I want to keep the three circle shaped. This is too much white, so I'm adding with leaf cream a bit. And then uh, the colors breathing 
each other too very much so I'd like to remove some of the dark green color that I painted to dark and that's not a good shade so I'm uh, remove some colors from the uh, center of the tree area I remove some color from the lightest area. And now I'm more adding cerulean blue on the reflected light area. I think it will make a painting that looks more 3D, 3 dimensional. Next, for the trunk, I'm mixing Bonsiena and Sap Green. Take a mixture to draw trunk as a first layer. And then take a thick Bonsiena to add on the dark part of the trunk. Then remove water from brush with paper towel because I need a brush that uh, doesn't too much water. I need an uh, almost to dry the brush because I don't want to spread the color quickly. And draw branches with dark Bonsiena. And let's draw ground and some shadow with the Serbian blue. Take a dark blue, I'll paint on it and tap it in the top of the ground to add on uniqueness and some story. And then try it one more touch up on the trunks and branches. I'd like to draw tiny balls here and there. When I draw balls, I feel so good. So I like to draw them often. I'm going to a spreader technique on the background with the cerulean blue. Tap the paper on the um, my desk and draw it, and the colors will go freely. I think it makes it makes a unique painting, right? And I spread the technique use again. Dark blue and tap it in the top of the ground and I'm going to um, give some detail in the trunk and then some branches Finally, I'm going to draw tiny leaves and branches on the lower part of the trees. 
branches and some uh, leaves. Throw tiny leaves. All right, we are all done today's painting. If you have a free time, please try again. Don't forget subscribe and hit the like button. See you next time. Bye.